Hello dear friends, welcome to Shiksha Mantra and when you have entered this particular discussion by clicking the thumbnail, one thing is sure. As a teacher, I know this. You are interested in learning adverbs and adverbials, how are they different and what's the relation adverbs and adverbials share. So there is nothing to declare what I am going to teach today. But one thing is very sure and I know you are also confused regarding these two things. You don't know why I have a screwdriver and a spoon with me. What are the functions of these screwdrivers and spoons here in our learning of adverbs and adverbials? But let me tell you another point dear friends. Besides the screwdriver and the spoon, I have another thing. Yes, this is a holder, a bulb holder. So, with the help of these three things, we would learn the difference between adverbs and adverbials. But uh, let me tell you one thing. I am not here to discuss those scholastic things. The things that uh, you usually get in your books, that you usually get in your uh, notes, whatever you follow. So it's not my goal. Rather, my goal is very simple. Whenever we speak of adverbs, what you say? You say that the adverbs actually are modifiers. They modify. But whom they modify? They modify either a verb or an adjective or another adverb. That's very, very sure. So there's nothing new in it. But the fact is, this definition, this definition of adverbs, it's not sufficient for you to understand the adverbials. Let me write down adverbials here and start our discussion from this very point. Yes, dear friends. Now, if I ask you, can you tell me which parts of speech adverbs belong to? If you ask, if I ask you, what's the parts of speech of adverbs? You would say, sir, what's the question? Adverbs are adverbs. But I am not going to that point, dear friends. I am asking you, we are learning adverbs. Now, what's the parts of speech of adverbs here? Obviously, it's a noun. And adverbials, this is also another noun. But adverbials are coined from adverbs. So, functionally, they are the same. If an adverb can modify a verb, an adjective or another adverb, that means an adverbial also modifies a verb, an adjective or another adverb. Now, I will say, sir, if everything is the same, then why should we need adverbs and adverbials? How are they different? Here, I would start the discussion with the help of some aids. As a teacher, we call them teaching aids or TLM. So, look at this holder first. Let me open it. And here, I have two screws. Uh, I think you can uh, watch it. I have two screws here. Now, if I want to open the screw, what I will do? I'll take a screwdriver and then I'll just rotate the screw with the screwdrivers and the screw would come up just like this. So now you can see the screw is in my hand. I have opened the screw. So it is when I have a screwdriver, the screwdriver does its function very easily and smoothly. Suppose I am in such a place, I am in a, uh, in a camp. 
and there I don't have a screwdriver but suddenly I need to open the screw and to uh, actually fashion a wear with this. So what I will do? I would search for something like this, like this spoon and with the spoon I would turn the screw just like what I have done with the screwdriver. Look, it's also opening. Just have a look at it, it's opening, isn't it? So here this spoon, it's not a screwdriver but it's performing the task of an adverb. It's performing the task of a screwdriver. So the spoon, though this is not a screwdriver, it's used to perform the function of a screwdriver. Yes, dear friends, that's the idea. We are doing the same thing with the adverbs and the adverbials. So what finally we get regarding adverbs and adverbials? Adverbials, they are something other than adverbs. So let me wipe the board first. So adverbs, just like the screwdriver does its job. It would be better if I uh, write a sentence here. Suppose uh, we take this sentence. The horse runs fast. So if you look at this sentence here, fast, this is fast is an adverb. Just like the screwdriver, we know this is an adverb. Why? Because it's uh, speaking of manner. So it's adverb of manner. But what happens if we write down the same sentence like this? The horse runs with a great speed. Here this with a great speed. This is not an adverb, rather this is a prepositional phrase. But this prepositional phrase is also talking of manner. So here we are using this prepositional phrase as adverb. That's why we call it adverbial. Yes, dear friends, it's so very simple. So what happens if we consider that of our screwdriver and of spoon? The screwdriver is the adverb and this holder, this holder is the sentence. So screwdriver is the adverb and it's performing is its task to turn the screw and open it. This is adverb. But when we don't have an adverb, what we will do? would find something else which is not an adverb like this spoon to perform the task of an adverb to perform the task of the screwdriver. We have considered the screwdriver at the, as the adverb and spoon as the adverbials. Yes, dear friends, the same thing is uh, happening here as well. If you look at what we are uh, doing here, you will find when we have used fast, this is an adverb, it's performing its task well but here a prepositional phrase with a great speed is performing the task of an adverb it's also modifying the verb as fast is modifying so fast is an adverb but with a great speed this is an adverbial so dear friends it's the time to come to our goal what is the difference between adverbs and adverbials here you may conclude that all adverbs are 
adverbials all adverbs are adverbials but all adverbials are not adverbs deliberately i am writing these in capital letter so that it would be easier for you to understand all adverbs are adverbials that means past this is also an adverbial but with a great speed this is an adverbial but this is not an adverb so when we get some other things other means not adverb but something else as to uh, perform the task of an adverb we call it adverbials so very simply we can conclude what are adverbials adverbials are what these three things either a word or a phrase or a clause which does the work of an adverb which performs the function of an adverb it can be either a single word or a phrase or a clause but one point that is very much important we must understand that when we call word these words are actually adverbs so we can use adverbs as adverbials because adverbs are always adverbials and when we talk of phrase here you'll get that we may get either the first point that is a prepositional phrase this is very very important we may get either a prepositional phrase or an infinitive phrase yes dear friends we may have either a prepositional phrase or an infinitive phrase both can work as adverbials and the third point we can get an adverb with intensifier yes dear friends they also can be used as adverbials so when we talk of adverbials we get three things in the form of a phrase that's either a prepositional phrase or an infinitive phrase or adverb with intensifier we would have the example for each and every one but before that example just uh, remember them these three things and a clause you know a clause can be used simply as an adverb and we call it adverbial clauses so before we shift to adverbials it's better for us to have an example how phrases can be used as adverbials so let's have the examples first we have already written the example and i am repeating it the horse runs fast so here we get the first sentence the second sentence is the horse runs with a great speed so here also in this sentence if you follow it first this is the word we have discussed so far and also this is adverbs as well as adverbials why i am repeating we have said all adverbs are adverbials but all adverbials aren't adverbs so this is the first point word and now with a great speed this is our prepositional phrase which is used as an adverb 
this is the prepositional phrase that we have used here as adverbs now we have the third point and that is what the third point is infinitive phrase fill in this form to join our club now in this sentence to join our club it's speaking of reason purpose so this is actually used as an adverb but this is an infinitive phrase yes dear friends that's how an infinitive phrase can be used as adverbials as adverbs that means adverbials so we have already these two these three points and now the point is how we may use an intensifier uh the horse let me use the same sentence here that would be easier for us to understand the horse run really very fast now if you consider this sentence fast this is the adjective for which we have used a very adverb and another really so really very fast together this is what this is an adverb phrase with intensifier this is also adverbial so this is the difference between adverbs and adverbials you don't have to learn so scholastic things just just remember these two things the screwdriver and the spoon the screwdriver is functioning its job but the spoon is functioning its job as a screwdriver so what does it mean it means adverbials can be formed without any adverb if you look at this sentence with a great speed with a great speed or to join our club to join our club here you won't get any adverb we don't have any adverb to join this is infinitive our you know it what is this this is adjective and club this is noun so to form adverbials it's not essential to have an adverb in the phrase the same thing happens for the clause as well fill in this form if you want to join our club just add if you want with this and you will get an adverbial clause fill in this form if you want to join our club so there is also we don't have an adverb so for the formation of adverbials to have an adverb is not is not essential what is essential the effect it produces the function it performs so when it works as an adverb a phrase a clause or a word we call it adverbials so remember dear friends adverbs and adverbials are really very easy we have very long discussion adverbials is a huge huge uh, grammatical chapter we we'll discuss about them in step by step but this is only the first part of our discussion of adverbials where we have already learned what's the difference between adverbs and adverbials and remember adverbials can be a single word as adverbs are adverbials all adverbs are adverbials but all adverbials aren't adverbs and with this let's uh, make an end of this discussion here we are returning very soon with the next part of our discussion of adverbials where we will learn how the adverbials will function in our sentences so there we will learn the uses of adverbials and we are returning very soon with this video stay tuned to our channel like and subscribe with the 
notifications so that you can get all the notifications whenever a new very much very very important and effective video of learning is uploaded here so stay tuned stay with us we are returning very soon till then bye bye happy learning